hello friend welcome to my channel macbook today i will tell you the mechanical engineering objective questions volume 2 i hope you have watched the volume 1 video so let's get started first question is the maximum shear stress theory is used for which type of material that is ductile material next question is the taper on a rectangular sunk key is answer is 1 in 100 question number 3 in blanking operation the clearance is provided on answer is punch next question is the toys and ornaments of non-ferrous alloys are made by that is slush casting by slush casting the toys and ornaments of non-ferrous alloys are made next question is core prints are provided on pattern 2 answer is to support the core and locate the core in the mold next question is a spherical drop of molten metal of radius 2 mm was found to solidify in 10 seconds a similar drop of radius 4 mm will solidify in that is 40 seconds next question misrun is a casting defect which occurs due to answer is insufficient fluidity of molten metal next question is a fluid is one which can be defined as a substance that answer is that can deform indefinitely under the action of smallest shear force next question is the taper or the taper on sunk key is given on top side only a streamlined body is defined as body about which the flow separation is suppressed next question is the angle of twist of shaft is inversely proportional to fourth power of a shaft diameter next question is a hollow shaft transmits blank torque than a solid shaft of the same mass and same material that is greater torque next question two shafts of same length and material are joined in series if the ratio of diameter is 2 then the ratio of their angle of twist will be 16 next question is the value of byte number is very small that is less than 0 0.1 when convective resistance of solid is negligible this question is related to heat transfer next question is the specific heat of an idle gas depends on its molecular weight and structure next question is misrun sorry muscle curve means curves at constant efficiency that is called muscle curve next question two shafts will have equal strength if twisting movement of both the shafts is same next question is a hot wire anemometer is a device used for measuring that is velocity of gases velocity of gases can be measured by the hot wire anemometer next question is the flow of water leaving the impeller in a centrifugal pump casting is free vortex flow next question is spouting velocity means idle velocity of a jet so thanks for the watching if you liked please hit the subscribe button for more video